This is a video of me making some pallet coasters. I have made a couple sets. And a couple people wanted to know how I made them. And it's a brief video. I'm not showing um, myself staining them and putting the shine on it. But it's just uh, how I cut them and put them together. Right here, I had cut a lot out, and I really looked at it, and it had holes in them, <laughs> in the wood, so I couldn't use that. I wasn't too happy about that. And this is me with my new wood. No holes. <laughs> um, These are, I'm cutting out for the slats. The measurements for the slats are three quarters, uh, about one quarter inch thick, four inches long. And the uh, three pieces that go in the middle to hold the slats up, those are three quarters by three quarters. Everything is, and everything is four inches long. But right here I'm cutting out for the slats. Four on top, three on the bottom. When the wood gets super thin, when I'm cutting on the table saw, I, um, I don't know, you probably missed it, but I go halfway through and then I pull it up, pull it out, and then I run it back through because it can get pretty dangerous when you're cutting thin wood. Um, right here I'm cutting the um, for the three pieces that goes in the middle. Uh, the three quarter by three quarter, about four inches. And I made your bow in it. And here I'm marking for the four inches, which I'll be cutting everything four inches. <clears throat> and after I mark it, I'll be um, putting up a stop block so I don't have to do any more measuring. I just do straight cuts. And it's faster that way. There's my little stop block I'm going to be using. So now it's just straight cutting, no more measuring. Okay, these are the three slats that goes in the middle. Um, I use a square to keep everything squared up. Um, here I started on the bottom. Like I said, it's three on the bottom and three slats on, I'm sorry, three slats on the bottom and four slats on the top. And just basically try to even them out. And I'll put something heavy on top just to push it down. Because I only use glue. I do. I don't use pin nails because eventually they uh, they pop up. And wood glue is strong as nails. 
strong once it dries. And so um, I only show the process of me putting the bottom on. I didn't um, show myself putting the top on because it's the same process. Um, right here I'm using the straw to get the, um, the glue that oozed out. And it's very, it it's so helpful for getting like, glue out of tight tight areas especially boxes the inside and there it is um paint them stain them whatever you and like to do if with you them. do make them send me a picture i'd like to see